Uh, he has since become a stuntman, and he does he does a lot of movies. He goes and goes to Europe and does doubles, does stunt work, and he rapes as well. So we kind of have a joke. There's kind of a um, high risk factor in our family is a gene, so we all kind of like to be daredevils. But I I kind of had the bug. I had to wait until my kids were older. They're now. 14 and 16, so I've been writing just over a year. Um, I've logged about 10,000 miles on my personal life. And um, I ended up attending, uh, I don't know if you guys are aware of the California Superbike School. Uh, Keith Code is the individual that started that. And when I was really interested in writing, I read all his books, saw his videos, didn't really understand about half of them, and decided I had to go and take the actual physical course to kind of get to know it. And the greatest thing about that was you ended up spending a little time in the classroom and a lot of time on the track. So whatever he taught you in the classroom, and if you go to the Street of Willows, I think they're basically located there, headquartered there. So Keith Code does actually show up and you know teach you in those actual classes, which is kind of cool. And everything you learn in the in the classroom, for like the five or ten minutes you're in there, you implement on the track, which you're on the track for another 20 to 40 minutes. So every lesson builds on itself. And I attended Street of Willows one and two, and ended up coming back implementing it here. And went back. Um, they did a one up here at Shelton, uh, the Ridge, is the new racetrack up there. So he brought his school up here to teach, and it was a two-day course also for level three and four. And that's actually where I met uh, Dave Sweezy. Um, he was taking a class with me, and it was actually great fun. And we ended up speaking a lot about our experiences on bikes. And he knew that I was interested in making my passion, my way of living, a business. And he kind of encouraged me to do it, and set me up with a lot of people that would kind of guide me in the right direction. And so I am now hopefully going to launch in the next couple of weeks, and it's called motivations.com, and it will be an online information and resource community for women. What's it called? Motivations.com? <laughs> 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 <laughs>